I-40 out there. And uh, Ashley, uh, just over your shoulder, though, it's almost uh, to see the people that are out of their cars, even with their animals out there, just trying to figure out what do we do and how are we going to get out of here? Robin Lacey and I want to let you know where we're at first and foremost. We are along I-40 westbound and we are coming up on Banner Road. I think there was a little bit of confusion when you guys were talking to Jim about where we were at. So we're not by Highway 81. But what we are seeing here is a lot of frustrated drivers again, as you guys said, just out of their cars, kind of hanging out, trying to figure out when they are going to get through. They've been stopping and asking us and I actually talked to the semi driver that's right next to me and I said, how long have you been waiting? He said an hour, and we're actually going to try and get up to these people here and see if we can talk to them. Actually, Jimmy, do you think that we can take the camera off and see if we can get this guy right here to talk to us? I know we're live on air, but we are going to see if we can walk up here and ask this guy live if he will talk to us right now. But again, a lot of frustrated drivers just bumper to bumper here. People have been here kind of coming up on the shoulder. We were driving on the shoulder trying just to get everyone a closer shot. But again, we're in a marked car, but we have some drivers like this one right here. Hi, sir. We're live on News 9. Do you mind if we ask you a few questions? Yeah, go right ahead. How long have you been waiting here? You told me a little bit ago, not too long, but how long have you been stuck here? Uh, about 45 minutes. 45 minutes. Yep. And you were walking up and down. What did you see when you went up there? Did you talk to some of those people that were waiting as well? Yeah, I did. I thought I was going to be a little slick and try to take the shoulder all the way in, but didn't work. Lots of flooding here. You don't know when you're going to be able to get up there, huh? No, I got a bag of pork grinds in the truck, and I reckon I'm just going to stay out here and eat my pork grinds and hang out. Might take a nap for a little while. And relax a little yeah. bit. Okay. Yeah. Well, thank you so much to talk for talking to us. Hey, thank Hopefully you. you get soon, you get by pretty thank soon. You. And this is what we're seeing here. Again, just the backup just goes quite a ways. I know that you had Jim shot a little bit earlier and he was probably able to give you a little bit of a better view. But again, we are coming up on Banner Road. We are in the westbound lanes and that is our car that you can see right there. More drivers just getting out on the phone, trying to see when they're are going to get through. I think Jim said that he could see some of the water receding and you guys just got an update from OHP. So we'll send it back inside to you guys for now. Oh, Ashley, such a good interview, Ashley. Real quick, I know we can get back on John again. Tell uh, John Boomer sooner where we saw the horns down, Ashley, from him. So <laughs> there he goes. And if he, uh, if his Halliburton bosses are watching this morning, John's going to be a little late. It is a, a, a true problem this morning, just a he couple was, of miles away. John was two miles away oh. from getting to work at the